Dvorak. Perfect evening for a game of football. Conditions are absolutely splendid. And the folk of this town have come out in their droves for this match. Why wouldn't they? It is an ideal circumstance for what could be an ideal game. Everybody has been attracted to it. It has been the talk of the town. And uh, the buses have been packed, double-decker buses lining up outside. Coaches have carried thousands of away supporters here too. And uh, all of it adds up to make a terrific and crackling atmosphere. The match, I think, will be quite a spectacle. The Emirates, which has become such a fine landmark, a part of the North London scenery. Jim, who do you reckon is pivotal? Or who else but Hazard? A slalom like Dribbler, who's afforded a certain amount of freedom to stray where he wishes. And he's also a more consistent finisher and the sharpest of turners of the box. Yes, he's certainly the one who carries the hopes of his team. Off we go then. Marcelo. Casemiro. And here's Bale. Goes for goal! And it's a goal! What a start. And what a contribution from the main man. I had a feeling he might do something given his reputation, but to do it like that, absolutely brilliant. I wasn't expecting that. Perfect placement, the one place the keeper couldn't reach. Well, you know, sometimes it pays off not to think too much about things, just put your foot through it, and that was a good example. Great contact, and the keeper had very little chance. Madrid take the early advantage. Very well to intervene. Bale. Casemiro. Forward it goes. Orellana. Uh, ball needed to be better there. It's a wasted chance. And here's Benzema. Bale. And it. Oh, Benzema has a goal! I can give the keeper a little sympathy here because I think he might have been slightly unsighted. However, credit where it's due, it's still a fine finish from a tight spot. Madrid get themselves a two-goal cushion. Well, unsurprisingly, Peter, the opposition look completely stunned. I'm not sure they can gather themselves. Bale, crunching tackle. Bale unable to make it happen for all his good intentions. And it's been intercepted, and that will come to nothing. Well positioned to make that interception. Marcelo goes looking. A real chance to break. It's Asa! Oh, that is rather wayward. Another example of how comfortable this team is on the break. Apar have it back and they can go again. Just to point out, Peter, that the fullbacks are quite high. And what do they try to achieve? Well, it's obviously a move to push um, the opposition wide men back and, and give them more to think about. And it's Bale. Modric. Tony Kroos. Marcelo. Tony Kroos. In with the challenge. Oh, he's going to be pulled back for that one.
fine save. Well, I thought a starting position was good, and that helped the keeper to judge the flight of the ball and, and deal with it well. Uh, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. The movement was good, but the pass lacked authority, uh, a cause of mild frustration. Madrid get it back again. Marcelo plays it forward. Modric. And here's Bale. Cruz. Chance! Carlo Oliveira gets it away. Doesn't get the pass he's looking for. Sergio Ramos, and it's half-time here. Any strong opinions on the first half? Well, they had their opponents reeling in that half, Peter, and the big main influence of change somehow, but don't hold me to it. Madrid sits in pretty here at half-time, 2-0 up. So, off we go once more. Paolo Oliveira drives it towards the front. Casemiro drives it forward. Has he found his man? Oh, good interception. Modric. And here's Benzema. Marcelo. It's wrestled off the ball. Marcelo is fouled. It's a little unfortunate, he had a lot of people worried then. Tries to get it forward quickly. Modric. Out to the left it goes. And here's Benzema. Hazard. Played into the middle. Tries to get it clear. Leon. Needs a bit of penetration to go with all this possession. Paolo Oliveira gets it forward. Tony Kroos. It's pretty clear that he's being singled out. Well, his stealth has been compromised because of his goal, and his treatment from here looks as if it could get a little tighter. Strong challenge, but well within the laws. He's left his man. That's great defensive work. It doesn't take too much imagination to guess what would have happened otherwise. It's admirable, but ultimately he didn't know when to look for support. Sergio Ramos does well to read it and intercepts. Paolo Oliveira looks to bypass the midfield. Hoists it forward. And that'll go straight through to the keeper. I wouldn't fancy playing up front in these circumstances, to be honest. There's absolutely no supply. Now it's Hazard. And it's Bale. Bale really just wasn't quick enough then. Well, his thinking certainly wasn't. Didn't make use of what I felt were some very good options. Leon plays it long. 
Looking for space out wide. We have got changes here from both sides, in fact. Well, that's where he wants it. The message is clear. None shall pass. Benzema. And the whistle has gone for a reckless challenge there. And he's going to have his name taken. And it's played forward. Alvaro Tejero. Eitar and a free kick. the whistle. Madrid did it. Terrific team effort to satisfy both the boss and the fans. Your final thoughts, Jim? Yeah, we knew there was a sizable gap.